All right, guys, welcome back to another reaction video. My name is James. I know, bro. And today we are going to be watching X Men First Class. So, um, last movie we watched was X Men Origins Wolverine. Um, this is kind of, kind of a soft reboot. I don't want to say too much, but basically it's like they're going to be different actors for most of the characters. Okay. <clears throat> um, so it's like the younger versions of the X Men. Um, kind of a little bit exploring some of the origins like a little bit of like a prequel um and and this is like a trilogy this is its own kind of universe trilogy so yeah it'll become clear as we go i really like some of the casting they chose for some of the younger characters the less i say the better okay. i think this is a really cool movie like i said you got to kind of look past some of the continuity inconsistencies especially because marvel is coming out at this time it just makes everybody look a little bit bad no that's fine um but yeah yeah i think it's still a really good movie and there's gonna be like a few different movies in a row that that this that follow from this movie with these actors um playing the characters. so that would be really cool um so yeah as always full length reaction is gonna be up the patreon next week's reaction is also gonna be up with the patreon if you guys want to go ahead and check that out. And yeah, thank you for joining us here. Thank you for watching. If you're new here, welcome. Um, hopefully you stick around, like, and subscribe. We'd love to have you. we got lots more X-Men stuff coming. We've watched a bunch of X-Men stuff already. And let's just get into X-Men First Class. Are there any X-Men characters that you want to see in this movie? Like, who are your top three characters that you want to see in the movie? Um, well, I mean, I want to see um, Magneto. Charles, Charles. Charles Xavier. Yeah, I want to see those two. I'm a little curious as to, like, what's up with, um, like, after Wolverine's whole ordeal. Yeah, yeah, Because, okay. like, I don't know if, like, that is supposed to be still a thing. This is cool that we're getting, um... More of this. Yeah. That's cool. And it, I think it's, it's really similar to how they showed it the last thing. Yeah, it, it really looks similar. So we're really flashing back. 1944. Yeah, okay. I thought, okay, this is, yeah. Yes. But actually, Wolverine would be around this time too. Yeah, the Wolverine could be through yeah, all of this. Yeah. Martha, what are you? I thought you wore a burger. <laughs> I'll make your hot chocolate. Who are you? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and what have you done with my mother? Dang. Set foot in this kitchen in her life. <laughs> and she certainly never made me a hot chocolate. <laughs> Is that. What's her name? Whoa, that's cool. But she's like a kid. Yeah, so this is because <laughs> it's a while back. And this is... You're not scared of me? No. I always believed I couldn't be the only one in the world. <laughs> Dude, this is cool. And here you are. Charles Xavier. <laughs> Raven. You never have to steal again. <laughs> Interesting. I, I just love the contrast between that and... You know, yeah, Eric. At the exact same time, basically. This is chocolate. This good. <laughs> Dude, you're so messed up. They gave us a disrusal. They did two to an annoying sight of that Eric. <laughs> I didn't know you. But you couldn't fit an insight. Hmm. Evolution. Kind of lines it's, up it's, with, uh... Yeah. His future self. Ich bitte dich und etwas ganz Einfaches. Eine kleine Münze ist gar nicht so im Vergleich zu einem großen Tor. Yeah, because he saw him. Oh, yeah. And they they probably, like, know, of right? Of course. It can't be, like... Ich habe es versucht, Herr Doktor. I mean, it was, like, intense emotion, right? That's I mean, the problem. And it's, just, it's, it's just awakening. See, that's the problem, bro. He knows that it's... Dude, focus, come on. <laughs> Dude, 
Dude, he's just like laughing. It's weird how he can do that, you oh. know? It's crazy. Dang, dude. It's just such a like a backwards relationship and yeah. he does such a good job of it. That coin. <laughs> it's gonna be uh... <laughs> That's cool. The music in this film is some of my favorite soundtracks of all time. It's incredible. <laughs> oh shoot. I mean I'll pay attention to it. <laughs> Heterochromia was in reference to your eyes, which I had to say are oh, staining. <laughs> I love seeing it was like a young dude. Yeah. Mutation took us from single celled organisms to being the dominant form of reproductive life on this planet. Yeah, I mean, technically everybody is a mutant. Each generation, all through mutation. Charles here was just telling me that I'm like one of the first sea creatures that grew legs. <laughs> Hi, Amy. And what are you studying? Waitressing. <laughs> Same. No. <laughs> Don't talk to me. You did that in focus. I did not. Yeah, it's just a little bit of sibling competition. Mutants and cows. I thought a pretty mutation for an invisible one was like yours. Look, look, I don't mean to sound like an old fart. Which you are. <laughs> well, not yet. A small sleep up is one thing a big one does not bear thinking about. Mutant and proud. Mutant and proud? Yeah, I mean, it's understandable with somebody like, like you know, Raven's mutation. Like, it's a lot harder in life to have that than what Xavier yeah. has. A young man would be lucky to have you. You're stunning. Looking like this. What? Blue? You're my oldest friend. I'm your only friend. Bro. Bro. But what if you didn't know me? Unfortunately, I do know you. I don't know what's gotten into it. You're freaking so oh, No, bro, you're avoiding the out. question, too. I mean, that, I mean, it is a tough question. That's a very tough question, right? I have to study. Oh, fine, read that. This is always going to be right off. <laughs> the Homo Neanderthalensis, his mutant cousin, Homo sapien, jour passager. Viens, c'est toi. Ton ami. That's such a cool shot. Where you can <laughs> see the reverse. Je vois. Vous connaissez nos conditions. Is it the same? Bro, come on. Uh oh. <laughs> 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 oh. Merci. Hello, girls. Wow. Yes. Yeah. Clearly, this guy's not going to be any help to you on this mission. Where is Mr. Shaw? We're having a party, and here's the entertainment. Come with me. Oh, how are you? Oh, yeah. Oh, snap. <laughs> Uh-oh. It's a secret. So I hear you blocked the proposal to position Jupiter missiles in Turkey. And you're looking at war. Nuclear war. Oh, this is dangerous, bro. Yeah, dude. Like, what are you going to oh do my gosh, if you wait, go down there? Wait, wait, wait. Or whatever you do. Do we have an escape plan? <laughs> no, no, we have zero escape plan. Uh oh. I can't read that, but I can assume. What the hell did you put in my drink? <laughs> mm. Maybe 
you can get through there. I don't know if you want to go through there, bro. We find you, Henry. There's not a fortress in the world that could keep us out. <laughs> Isn't, um, is that supposed to be the one? I don't know if it's supposed to be the one in Origins or not. Okay. Genetic mutation. I know Emma Frost is a big character in the comics. Where's his Hazel? Uh oh. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Whoa. With the fire. That's cool. <laughs> but you recognize the guy running the like like with the mutants and stuff is the same. Yeah. Oh, is he? Yes. Yeah. Hey, these guys are they? Was hat sie nach Argentinien verschlagen? Ach, das Klima. Ich bin Schweinebauer. Okay, sure. Meine Eltern kamen aus Düsseldorf. Oh. Oh, dude, the music. That's gonna work, buddy. Ooh. Let's just say I'm Frankenstein's monster. I'm looking for my creator. Dude. Uh oh. Literally one of the coolest scenes ever. Is it Michael Fassbender as like a young Magneto? So I, I yeah. think the casting is like perfect. Oh my god. He clearly has some maturing to do. <laughs> uh oh. I think we should just talk when you're sober. Do you have any time tomorrow? It's me, you already know the answer to your question. <laughs> yeah. If I can help you, I will do my utmost. I like how he does like the little hand thing. That's cool too. No one. He's telling the truth. Good. Oh wait, what? So she could read minds too. That's crazy. Yeah. Well, I knew better than to trust you. Go ahead. <laughs> I'll do it. I swear to God. But I will. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. I've got the power to absorb energy. It keeps me up. That's why he's still going. Oh, no wonder. Isn't that so such a cool power? That is cool. And the animation, like the, the visual the visual effect of it is su it's just Yeah. I haven't been entirely honest with you, love. I'm sorry. You see, one of the many spectacular things my mutation allows me to do. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've seen this before in a magic show. Are you going to ask us to think of a number between 1 and 10 now? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Frank, that was a little not smart of him to do. Like, <sighs> yeah, but maybe this will work. This will work, but he forced her to do yeah. this, you know? <laughs> oh, shoot. I mean, that's... <laughs> That's selfless of her to do. Is that for a magic trick? <laughs> Best I've ever seen. Oh, Absolutely weird. I... I've just frozen him for a moment because I'd like to talk to you. I thought the freaking <laughs> movie paused. I'm still unsure what you are, and if you still want my help, meet me on the third floor of the parking garage. I've always known that there were. <laughs> That's so cool. You're gonna love my facility. It's gonna have to work. Why? Benjamin Tiger has a lead on Sebastian Shaw. If we don't move now, apparently we're going to lose him. Communicate with them as well. Lord, I just had a lovely conversation. Yes, we did. That is incredible. <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> I like this guy. Where else? Without permission from upstairs. Would you like to see one more magic trick? Okay. Get the car. Good idea. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, but so, was he a mutant? He must have been. Are they always? Must have been. That's kind of crazy. Hey, Doctor. Also, the Kleiner Eric Lindsay. Huh. Oh. Bro, you gotta be careful, man. Shoot. Oh, man, dude, like, come on, you can't just. Oh. I love Emma Frost power. I just like seeing more of these powers and maybe a little bit more like, you know, effects and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, what's that? She can block stuff too? Dang, she's really versatile. Yeah. You need some combat. Yeah. We need some combat like mutants, you know? Like. You know I mean. <laughs> Eric's yeah. help. That's true. There's someone else out there. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Oh my gosh. Got a sub. It it feels like a like a '60s spy movie, but also X Men, which is such a cool idea. Ooh, yeah, shoot, dude, you can't. He can't. Please, Eric, calm your. Dude, the fact that he's a mutant though makes this like way harder. Yes. guy's name was it that is this gonna be like the helmet <laughs> maybe that's dang oh yeah what am I thinking can't tell and little hints of the future coming up I was thinking that you are the most exquisite thing I've ever seen in my life this needs ice. <laughs> yeah, he's got a little controlling. Uh, well, to be expected. I like it though. Like I never realized how much of like a not a parody, but like reference to like some of those like OG like spy movies and stuff. Yeah. It is. Like oh, they got the femme fatale and the evil submarine and all that kind of stuff. No idea what I'd give to feel. Normal. <laughs> I think this serum that you're making, it doesn't affect abilities, right? Just appearance. Normalizes it. I mean, that's crazy. Yeah. Excited. You know, the, the, the nature of your mutation. <laughs> it, it's yours. Oh, yeah. Being forward, that's kind of what I meant. No. But I'm just... <laughs> Go ahead. Take the blood. Well, okay, now he's a little distracted, bro. Come on, you know what you're doing here. Sorry, sorry. 
I felt your agony. Yeah, he actually does literally understand your pain. I mean, he's probably one of the only people that that can can't understand you, right? That's. I don't need your help. Don't kid yourself. You needed my help last night. It's not just me you're walking away from. I won't stop you near it. I could, but I won't. <laughs> She always got friends. Turn that radar installation into a transmitter. It's designed to amplify brain waves. Cool. Help us find other mutants for our division. What if they don't want to be found by you? Nick. <laughs> oh, he's back. If a new species is being discovered, it should be by its own kind. Charles and I find the mutants. No suits. Yeah. What an adorable lab rat you make, Charles. <laughs> It looks like one of those things you put on your hair, you know, like the air dryers at those hairdressers. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Charles. I mean, this has got to be a little bit like. It's shouldn't scary, you prepare man. for this, though? Like, yeah. I, I don't know. Is he used to this? This is a little much. I'm trying to look for the Easter eggs, bro. I'm trying to see if I can recognize anybody. <laughs> that was a cool transition. Yeah. It's got style. <laughs> what if I do? Oh, like, yeah. It's like wings. It looks like, um... Also, like dragon like a dragonfly, fly. yeah, yeah. How do you like a job where you get to keep your clothes on? No, we'd rather have to take us all the way. That's a six-hour drive. That will give us plenty of time to talk. <laughs> that was cool. <laughs> I like this. I'd rather go out with the fish. Oh, come oh, on, bro. Dang. <laughs> Cool set piece. Beautiful, isn't it? The reason we exist. You go on to Russia. I'll handle them. Really? By yourself? Dang. That's some <laughs> confidence right there. All those minds that I touched. I could feel them. The rest of my ambitions. The chess. I tell you, we're the start of something incredible, Eric. We should think of code names. We're government agents now. We should have to. <laughs> Damn, I want to be called Mystique. <laughs> <laughs> no, I called it. Whoa. Ooh. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> wow. Banshee, why do you want to be named after a whaling spirit? Whoa, dude. Whoa. <laughs> 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 Why? Uh-huh. And, uh... No! You know. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa that's... That's dangerous. <laughs> that's a little scary. So guys. I think, because you were recognizing the name, I think he's supposed to be Scott's brother? Oh, okay. Right, because Scott Summers would be Cyclops. Okay. I think. I'm not sure, actually. I never made that. I, I heard the Summers name, too, and I was like, I think, because they have kind of similar powers. And... Yeah, something like that. We have to call him Havoc. That's his name now. And we were thinking, you should be Professor X, and you should be Magneto. I expect more from you. Yeah, like, 
Yeah, I mean, this is serious. Because this is like the exact problem is like why people are scared of mutants, of right? Course. It's like, you know, sure, you want to have fun, but you got to realize that like you're different. Well, and and the mutations and will, uh, like reveal themselves like kind of around puberty, right? So it's like you have really young people yeah, dealing with these like, problems. You have to, especially since it can cause actual danger, right, yeah. to people. You got to be like a little more, you know, aware of that. Shaw sends his apologies, but he's indisposed. He asked me to come in his place. And between you and I, honey, I'm a lot better company. Something to know, boss. No, nothing. We're here for Shaw. Mission aborted. <laughs> Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. CIA invading the home of a senior Soviet official. Are you crazy? I'm not sorry. <laughs> oh, shoot. Uh... Oh, no. I mean, I get it, though. Bro. I get Eric, because it's like, let's stop wasting time. Like what? We have to... Oh, shoot, no. Yeah, now you're going to abandon him? <laughs> I mean, at this point, though, is there any way to, like... Why don't we just go for it, right? Maybe... So strong even now, dude. Interesting. Pathetic. <laughs> She's really <laughs> strong. She's very strong. Whoa. I love the crystal effect too. Yeah, yeah, that's really it cool. looks really cool. You're never going to get anything from me while I'm like this. <laughs> <laughs> Dude. I like this sort of like, um, you know, like the sort of like. Uh, based off of real history, kind of history, yeah, yeah, but like, yeah. it's like you know. <laughs> Beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I mean, well, that was pretty successful, though. Yeah, but Shaw, we gotta worry about him, right? I did somewhere. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know the circus was in town. Hey, come on, can you give us a little? Uh, <laughs> well. Who hired these, like... I know, here, really? Really, like, bro? The worst place. Hey. Why do we have a giant window, yeah. honestly? That's what the sound's been. Guys. Uh oh. I love how hardcore this movie. Like, it's still PG 13, yeah. but it's hardcore. No, yeah. Where do I find the more evolved people? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Guys, why don't we have countermeasures? Give him for this? more energy. <laughs> that guy's got a lot of power. Whoa, holy Ooh. crap, bro. Okay. Guys, time to pull out the powers, yeah, okay? Can, can we, like, uh, I mean, they're young, but... Yeah, but now you gotta do something. Nothing to be ashamed of. It's understandable, and he's like tapping into that. We have to do something. But they just murdered. Yeah, a lot of people. Like. I'm coming with you. Good choice. It. Oh shoot! I don't know. Is he? I'm worried for him. 
Well, I got to survive. Uh oh, what we doing? Ooh. Alex, do it. <laughs> Ooh. Dude, oh no! He has such a yes, broken it's ability. So OP. What the freak? No. Like the only dude willing to stand up. Of course. Yes, we do. <laughs> Fine question. Though I won't call it a war exactly. That suggests both sides stand an equal chance of winning. I mean, that's half of a good movie is an awesome bad guy, and I can say this movie does that right. Yep. Living in such hardship. Well, it was a hardship it's softened hard. by me. It's a different kind of hardship. Like, obviously it's not as bad as Eric, but... Dang, man, that's looking... Oh, it's looking awesome. No, I can't, I'm sorry. Smile yeah, on bro, Eric's face. Yeah, bro, you're smiling a bit too much there, like... I can deflect it. You're always telling me I should push myself. If you know you can okay, do but... it, then you're not challenging yourself. Yeah. Let's try something a little more challenging. <laughs> That's why we have this bunker built down here. So we could use it as a practice range. Perfect Ooh. training ground. It's because you can't control it. It controls you. Yeah, don't run away from it because you can't control it. Learn to. Yeah, practice. <laughs> I love seeing him good at what he does. Yeah. Two natures, two natures are a ball. Robert Lewis Stevenson, Jack Long Island. Tell So he wasn't really that good. Shut the door. Yeah. Yeah, bro. Shut the door. Bro, you gotta get a bigger fire extinguisher. I will teach you to control this out. You're sure that this will work? Anything is possible. I based the design. Stop doing things. Catch with the right angle, and they should. Oh, <laughs> that's crazy. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> what no. the? Those feet, man. Uh, congratulations, my friend. <laughs> Impressive, eh? Right? Like those, all you need is a red nose. Right, Buzzer? Oh, come on, dude. <laughs> you want society to accept you, but you can't even accept yourself. Yeah, interesting. Look, <laughs> we're gonna get out of here. Ooh. Whoa, I mean, that's way better. Yeah, yo, <laughs> that's how you. <laughs> Usually, uh, yeah. That's how I aim in video games. Life. <laughs> Incredible cellular structure I've ever seen. Yes. Oh. oh, yeah, that makes me go supersonic. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it worked. I mean, Eric probably could have caught him, too. Uh, Whoa. <laughs> I mean, that's what they need. Still a bozo? Yes, Hank, you're still a bozo. <laughs> I'm sorry, Hank. You don't deserve the hate. You know, I believe the true focus lies somewhere between rage and serenity. That's a really cool way of yeah. showing that. And I I love this track is is called Rage and Serenity, and I just love the idea of that. Like okay. that that is where the true strength is. I access the brightest corner of your memory system. Very beautiful memory, Eric. Thank you. It's good too, I felt. And you can access all of that. 
You'll possess a power no one can match. Come on. Try again. <sighs> it's just so cool to see them That together, was really man. cool. <laughs> <laughs> that was really cool. That was a really cool moment. Hey! Hold on. The president's about to make his address. For the likelihood of an atomic attack, there are widespread reports of panic buying. Supermarkets clear as shelters. Can we talk about how bougie he is that he has a television in his submarine in the 60s? <laughs> Prime for war. Okay, bro. Like, relax a little bit. <laughs> I, I isolated the right marker in your DNA sample. The serum works like an antibiotic, attacking the cells that cause our physical mutation. Should we have to hide? Yeah, I mean. You already do. You're hiding right now, like I have my own life. Hank, don't. You're beautiful, Hank. Everything you are, you are perfect. We are different. But we shouldn't be trying to fit into society. Mutant and proud. <laughs> My feet, your natural blue form, never be deemed beautiful. You look beautiful now. Oh, that's. I mean, that's horrible. That sucks. I, I, I understand. I, I, I get really it. understand. Yeah, I get it, but like. Uh, yeah, I really get both sides. It's, it's horrible, both sides. Russia, America, makes no difference. She was declared war on mankind, on all of us. I'm not gonna stop Shaw. I'm gonna kill him. Do you have it in you to allow that? It started as a covert mission. Tomorrow, mankind will know that mutants exist. Shaw, us, they won't differentiate. Okay. Yeah. Not if we can prevent Shaw, not if we risk our lives doing so. But they do the same for us. We have it in us to be the better man. We already are. Better yeah, in a but different you think better. way. After tomorrow, they're going to turn on us. But you're blind, Ted. Because you believe they're all like Moira. And you believe they're all like Shaw. Yeah, you guys are both maybe a little bit naive on, on either end. Yeah, but it's... Killing <sighs> Shaw will not bring you peace. Peace was never an option. <laughs> What, what? <laughs> I mean, it looks like it. I mean, I really understand, Hank. No, of course. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> I just realized that looks like the version of, of, of Raven that we see in the, the originals. <laughs> Perfection. Isn't that a meme? Yes. <laughs> I just realized. Pass me my rule. You don't have to hide. Uh, that's how she goes over to his side. On your life, the world is trying to take you. It's so understandable, though, because he... Like, I get it. I get it, and I think it is right for her in a way. Like, this is helping her in a way that Charles wasn't. There's none of us mutated to endure extreme G-force or being a by bullets. I suggest we suit up. <laughs> oh, snap. <laughs> This music man with the electric guitar. And the suits in the comics are blue and yellow. That's cool. <laughs> like, wait a second. Some stuff happened. Is who you were meant to be. This is you. That's real quick, man. Put him down immediately, please. Hike, hike! I 
wasn't. Even I gotta admit, you look pretty badass. I think I got a new name for you. Beast. I just love that. I forgot about that moment with Magneto where it's like, dude, he's strong. Yeah. General quarters, general quarters. All hands, man. I think that's uh, subs and stuff too with the nukes yeah. that they could have used. But they were like, they didn't want to because, and they, I think there was a story of that where they they had no communication with their like higher up. Oh yeah, and they all, like they could have, right? Yeah. Or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go! Everybody's like, uh, wh whose country is that from? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Uh, I feel like you gotta stop that first. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> They're fried on their own ship. A little warning next time, Professor. <laughs> yeah. A little, little. I mean, he had to do it. Give me some clan on the horn. I want a new set of words. <laughs> yeah, what do we do now? <laughs> that telepath is powerful. We're moving to a backup plan. Oh, no. <sighs> so, come on, look at show. He's down there. We need to find him now. He's in his little submarine thing. And obviously we don't have sonar. Wait. Yes, we do. Don't we? Yeah. Yeah. The nuclear reactor to 100% output and make uh, sure uh, I'm not disturbed. Yeah. Great. Yeah, you thought he was OP before, bro. Now he's going to have a lot of energies. Mm. <laughs> That's sick. Woo! <laughs> so you had to train your dragon over here. <laughs> mm. <laughs> That's got a. I could kill someone easily. They're like, uh, what is happening? Yeah. The point between rage and serenity. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's so cool. <laughs> what? Guys, uh, we're just gonna leave it. Are we fighting Russia or aliens? Can you like? Oh. Storing all the power out of the shut, setting himself with some kind of nuclear bomb. We got no time to die. Gosh. I can guide you through it once you're in, but I need you to shut down whatever it is that's blocking me, and then we just hope to God it's not too late for me to stop him. Got it. Good luck. Yeah. Stop taking care of it, yes? Fine. Come on, bro. We gotta work as a team. <laughs> Get wrecked, dude. You go. You go. Yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of here. Not that dude dumb storm dumb. guy just got wrecked by everybody. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I like how he trusts Eric too. Like or, or sorry, Charles. Like he, Eric, Charles is in his head. Yeah. Charles Charles not here. He's left the sun. What he's got to be there. He has No, you just gotta look for the secret room. No, there's no one here, goddammit! <sighs> So good to see you again. He just absorbed like part of a nuclear reactor. At least reactor. half of a nuclear reactor, yeah. Hmm. Nice. I like how we follow them. It's like, dang. Yeah. Dude, why are you going in here? What are you doing? 
Watch out, guys. Yeah, bro. Oof. I'm sorry for what happened to the guy. Yeah, dude, he's Don't let him play you. Spike! <laughs> Eric, what are you doing? Keep doing it. It's starting to work. He's so Dang. broken because like his power isn't limited to just metal, it's just power. Yes! You know? And because it's like he went to a nuclear reactor, he's yeah. ultimate. <laughs> Uh-oh. Ooh! Nice. Good. <laughs> Good play. This world could be ours. Yeah, I like how he's still trying to recruit him. Made me the weapon I am today. I've known it all along. <laughs> you got played, Shaw. Sorry, Charles. Eric, please be the better man. You have to let him trust you. Eric, there will be no. Uh oh. He's gonna kill him. <laughs> I'd like you to know that I agree with every word you've said. We are the future. Unfortunately, you killed my mother. <laughs> oh, the coin. <laughs> Three. And I'm going to move the coin. <laughs> but but man, Charles is in his head. It, yeah, the thing is, like, bro, it's so selfish. Like, bro, why? But he can't let him go. <sighs> oh, the shot, dude. Oh. <laughs> that's that's a cool shot. Your blinders, brothers and sisters. The real enemy is out there. <laughs> Tell me I'm wrong. No, he's not. I mean, wrong. no, he isn't at all. But it's still like, like he's like he's to do Magneto. He's the like, ne Neanderthals, like you know. Hello. Hello. <laughs> the shot. Damn. <laughs> He has been unleashed. Eric, you said yourself, we're the better man. Uh -oh. Yeah, I mean... Yeah. You have to. Is that is that why he's gonna have the the wheelchair? Possibly. Does it hit him like right? Yeah. It's fine. I'm so sorry. No, I said back off. You did this. No, bro. It was you. You didn't do this, Hack. You did. Yeah. I don't think you do, actually. Yeah. We form our own. The humans have played their hand. Now we get ready to play ours. Don't you hide it? Yeah. Yeah. You should go with them. It's what you want. Folks, you're driving these things in the face. 
I'm sorry. Mutants, I'm proud. <laughs> Charles, don't move over. Okay? Oh, what? <sighs> I can't feel my legs. So, how many students do you think you'll have here once you get the academy up and running? <laughs> Oh, the chair, cool. bro. I suppose I'm a real professor now, aren't I? Next thing you know, I'll be going bald. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bro. <laughs> well, you're your own team now. It's better. X-Men. <laughs> it's a light sound of it. Uh, that was pretty well played. Come on, bro. <laughs> it's a new boss. <laughs> Oh, oh snap. Where's your telepath friend? There, I believe. <laughs> like me too. Oh. <laughs> With the comic book. Uh. What'd you think? I thought that was really cool. I like I liked seeing you know, like while I do like the the older um, actors, I mean, they played it really well. I think the young actors of everybody is so, especially Michael Fassbender who plays Magneto. He's amazing. Yeah, like, like I love Ian McKellen. He's the greatest, of course. But dude, he is so cool in this movie, and it's yeah. so perfect. Mm -hmm. No, yeah, I, he's able to kind of like. Yeah, and during those, like, you know, tough moments, he's able to really show those emotions. His right? acting is incredible. Like, like the whole scene, like, it's so underrated where he's, like, tearing. He has this balance of, like, tearing up and intensity. Like, yeah. all the Shaw scenes mean so much more purely because of his performance. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I mean, what do you think of the plot in general? Like, I think it's kind of cool. Like I said, it's kind of like a soft reboot-ish. Not really, but they're kind of bringing new life to the franchise. No, it's cool. I, it's cool to kind of, like, you know... Um Kind of get a little more uh, backstory, like reasons as to why, you know, it, it kind of fleshes it out more so mm -hmm. that, you know, um, the the events that happen later are, they're more impactful. Yeah. yeah and you yeah, can yeah. understand, you know, a little more, right? Yeah. So it, it's cool. I like seeing that. And then, um, you know, just seeing everyone's powers kind of like um you know before they were completely experienced with them and things like that is really interesting especially with like um magneto right he yeah his whole you know the source of power is like his hatred mm -hmm. and his anger and his pain and then um charles kind of like bring him out of that oh. Almost making him a better villain. Yeah, well, a stronger Cause, cause, cause person. I almost feel like Charles could have beat him before. Whereas now, yeah. it's like that calm, cool, collected Magneto that we know. It's kind of, it's... it's. Well, it's because he, he taught him to be a better person, a stronger yeah. person, you know, that he's now able to be... Um, you know, a more dangerous sort of villain, right? Yeah, and I, I just, I love the, 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 it feels a little bit more like a comic book movie than some of the others. It's very flashy, it's very colorful, but at the same time, it's very grounded. Um, and I love the brother relationship. Like, Eric and Charles really feel like brothers, and I think that that is the perfect way to do, like, an origin. Yeah. And it, 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 it's this perfect balance of being its own thing while just making um, the original series, like, better. Like, it's so, not, like, supportive, but respectful. Yeah, for sure. Of the source material and really just, like, amplifies the ideas and the tones and the message. I, I think that's beautiful. No, yeah. I also like, um, you know, just a little bit of stuff with, like, Mystique and things like that. And how yeah. they, you know, showing, like, how she was actually on um, Charles' side mm -hmm. in the beginning, you know. Mm -hmm. So that, that's pretty cool. And then, you know, her gradual shift over... Uh, to Magneto's um, sort of thought process and stuff and how um, what's his name? Beast? 
Yeah, Beast, how Hank. he was also involved. Yeah, you know, I like seeing that. I it's like seeing him, and I, it's it's so funny because we were watching like the originals, and you're like, oh, I really like Beast. I hope we see more of him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really yeah. like the Eric Charles relationship, and I was like, mm, first class. No, for sure. <laughs> The, this this uh, this movie definitely uh, you know gave me a lot more of that, which is it's really cool. You know, I, I like um, you know seeing their different sort of like you know perspectives on things like that, and you know it's cool to see how understandable it is and whatnot, and how um, Charles still even understanding or. You know, even understanding um, Magnino, he still he still sticks to what he believes in. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And it's cool that um, you know, of course, we already know that Magnino was going to turn bad, but it's it's still cool to see the like, you know, how he doesn't he doesn't um, completely ever lean toward Charles' side. He's always... No, and, but he never goes full evil, really, either. Like, this movie, yeah. it's it's like, well, I get it, and... and it's, yeah. It's, it's... I don't know. It, they do it... I, I Obviously, he's the villain, but they do it so beautifully. No, yeah. And I, what I really like about this movie that I, I kind of forgot is looking at them as teachers. Because, like, what we were... Well, the only thing we've seen so far, and I don't know if they announced it when this movie came out, but just so you know... They're gonna do like prequel movies every ten years. So this is like the sixties, and they're gonna do like one in the seventies, and and so forth. I believe until they catch up to modern time. Or at least that was the, the plan. Okay. Um, Interesting. But I think it's really cool seeing them as teachers and seeing, especially like Charles. Of course, like we get hints of Charles, but he's honestly not as big of a character as I would have even maybe liked in the original trilogy, especially in two and three. Whereas yeah. here I love seeing what he is good at and then seeing that fail with Mystique or even a little bit Bantry and seeing Magneto come in and it's like together they're actually kind of the perfect balance and it's almost like a part they they both make mistakes. Like Charles mm-hmm. makes mistakes with the Raven and you know Magneto makes mistakes. I, I don't know, I think it's kind of cool. Yeah, it's interesting. It's an interesting sort of like um you know, combination that they got going there and that, you know, no one is, you know, perfect as a human. It's interesting. Yeah. Which is the, I thought the action is really cool in this movie. No, action And the villain. Really cool. Yeah, the villain was really cool. The power was really, really interesting, you know. And he, you know, he felt very, um, yeah, intimidating and just like the way he kind of carried himself was like, oh gosh, you know, we're going to have to deal with this guy, you know. Especially after seeing how powerful Magneto is and then seeing how, you know, even Magneto struggles, you know, to fight him. It's well, it's really, cool. It's really cool. I mean, I think that's like a filmmaking challenge that's underappreciated, too. Like, if you showed me the X-Men movies and then you were like, okay, we need a villain before Magneto. I'd be like, dude, like, Magneto is, that's like being like, you know, create the villain before Darth Vader. And you're like, you know, it's, it's, it's he's it's iconic. Do, and yeah. so the... You know, it's it's underappreciated, I think, sometimes how hard that is to do. Like, Kevin Bacon is a great acting job. I just like the, even the tragedy of Magneto, where it's like, you know, as much as Magneto hated this person, he does become exactly who Shaw wanted him to become. Yeah. To the point, frankly, that he kills Shaw. Like, him killing Shaw obviously seals his fate, but it's also the most Shaw thing he could ever do. Yeah. Um, which is... Poetic, frankly. It's it's really horrible and tragic and I don't know, I feel like this movie's more of a tragedy than anything else. More than an origin story, it's a tragedy. Yeah, it is because it shows um the point where Magneto truly does become a villain. Right? Yeah, and, and it's almost like like they're both young and so they both just missed the mark where like Magneto could have been better and he wasn't and even Charles with Mystique he could have been better but he wasn't because I think it's really I mean, interesting that he says like I failed you and he tells her to go which I think is a really interesting response. Yeah, I'm not sure if uh, Magneto missed the mark. I feel like it, he's very different than Mystique. I feel like Ma- Magneto there was almost no chance that Magneto would would not would change. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but whereas Mystique, there is that, right? Um, yeah, it, you're right. It is It is cool that it, it is like a tragedy. It's It's cool. And it's interesting to see that, um, you know, even after going through what he did, 
and of course killing um Shaw, he still does end up almost exactly like him. You know? Yeah. Which is interesting. But he still won't kill Charles. Like like it's so well even the way they do the whole bullet thing and he's like sitting there and he feels bad I just love like like the acting, the writing, everything about it, it it captures so well that like perfect balance between like they're clashing but he never wants to kill him or anything yeah. like that. And it's and I think it's so cool. I don't know if this is how it happens in the comics, but the fact that he's the one that makes Charles crippled mm-hmm. but not on purpose. Like it's it's the perfect I clearly I'm obsessed with this movie. <laughs> but it's kind of like the perfect representation of their relationship. Where yeah. it's like Charles is willing to sacrifice anything. And Eric doesn't mean to hurt him, but in his kind of own idealism, there's collateral. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I just think that's no. Yeah, it's 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 cool. It's I like that they are able to kind of like you know get that sort of like companionship across. Where it's like they're still antagonists to each other, but you know he's he still thinks of them as like on the same side in a way because of now that there again i'm not sure if it's here they they kind of delve into it more because he understands more not just um this whole physical side of things but like because he can read his thoughts charles Mm -hmm. knows kind of like what magneto went through and things like that yeah right so it's kind of it's on the fence as to whether or not um, he looks at Charles as on the same side because of simply his attributes, because mm-hmm. he's not normal, mm-hmm. right? Which I would have assumed was the case um, in the first movies, right? Yeah. And I still do think it is kind of that, but there is a hint of like, um, you know, you can understand what I went through. Yeah. So, you know, he sees him as like a friend. Yeah. In a way. We got our little Logan cat ca- dude. That's my that favorite cool. cameo. It's so well done. It's I like, like the perfect balance. Yeah, I personally kind of wanted um, Wolverine to actually be in it, but that's fine. I, I that was the perfect sort of like. I mean, we'll see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see. It's cool because it's like, you know, people always like talk about like, oh, there's you know, he Wolverine has to be in every X Men movie. <laughs> it's at least so far. Oh, he was in. <laughs> <laughs> um. So yeah. We'll see. We'll see what happens in, in the next movie. Um, but yeah, thank you for joining us here. Thank you for watching us. We're going to keep watching X-Men movies, obviously. As always, um, the full-length reaction is going to be up on the Patreon as well as next week's reaction, which is going to be... If you want to go ahead and check that out, get a little early access, feel free to. But obviously, you don't have to. Really, just thank you for joining us here. Thank you for watching. If you're new here, welcome. Um, hopefully, you stick around, like, and subscribe. And if you do... We'll see you all in the next video.